Welcome back to Eater Race. This is week 231, day seven, the final day. And as you can see right here, we have about 24 minutes left and we have two matches to go to, to get through. So let's get started. Um, luckily there is, I think only two defense replays we have to watch. Uh, what kind of saves do they have? Near save and far save. That means you're not a save, you're just um, hmm. Edelgar, no weapon. So the only ones that have weapons, I guess, are Meteos is for the bolt protection. And Edelgar, because she can hit. I think we're going to go with our player face team on this one. Hmm. I wish it was the other uh, Erica. If it was the other Erica, then yeah, I think maybe would have been better. I don't have any armor effectiveness. I guess we can go with this team. I mean. Their fallen Edelgard doesn't have a weapon. It's just a stall team. It's kind of annoying. I think not. That's all it is. It's just annoying because of the stall. Alright. So we're gonna go like this. We're gonna send air just to hit for Mortis. And go here dance you from underneath move and then we can put you over here all right it works for me Alone no longer. Mm, maybe this way as you say mm, we don't do a lot of damage to him and he does get protected by that healing tower. I am torn. Mm, this might be much, much more annoying than I expected. But I think we can force him to move. If I remember correctly, there is a way that you can just force him to move. So this is probably the real one, this is just too inconvenient for them for it to be, yeah they transform. Why? Oh, because for Mortis, duh. Not that it really matters since, again, this is just a stall team. Yeah, the rallies is the only thing that's gonna keep them together. So I needed to have brought like something to stop the rallies. Yeah, it's pretty much a loss. I mean, if I can really do any damage to them, mostly because. I would need like no follow up or something. Oh. Lord Asker guide us as you say. Yeah, let's just quick. There's no point in. Yeah, if I had like Lynn, not Lynn, um, the other Erica, that's better for player face. But yeah, this was just an armor stall. Another thing that could have helped was like if I brought um, Mila for isolation, 
then they would have had to move out of the way. All right, this is also far safe with air, not air, Fjorm. Mm, don't really have a way to get from here to here. For taking out their Fjorm right off the bat. I guess I could just put, if I put, break this, unit will come down and attack, uh, and I can put like, mythic air over here. But then, what else do I need? Well, I, I'm gonna go with the same thing, just because the, It's easier to deal with Ambla with uh, Grima than anybody else. Good morning. All right, so break this. Move you here move you here to take this and then dance for the um for the buffs so she can get debuff and then just stick on uni They have a healing tower? They don't even have a healing tower, so... goes legendary corn that means a unit does die because she clearly did zero damage to us right here yep there goes uni actually no we die and once, I guess, no, actually, oh yeah, yeah, she didn't attack because I didn't open up a path for her. Again, this is so bold, so I'm just gonna go for it. what I wanted to do. I go. Maybe this way. There we go. Lord, ask her, guide us. Upon your word. Yeah, even with the damage reduction, I mean, even with 
not the damage reduction, even with the damage increase, is what I meant to say. Alright, we can take you out, and we can take you out, so let's take you out first. Break this. Alright, and then so left is Ascended Fjorm. Guess if I had an attack into Ascended Fjorm. I don't know, I have to see how much uh, HP Air had. Like, I would have liked to initiate with Ascended Air, but <laughs> the the grass right there definitely did not allow for that. This is a very nice Sotis. I don't have that kind of uh, fodder to give mine. Alright, let's do the final match of the season. 12 minutes, let's try to not take all 12 minutes. Again, this is a season without far save, so... I guess... Leaf can go one, one, two, three right here. But on this side, he can only go one, two, three. Three. Uh, we'll go with um, our magic team. Magic team. Magic team. I have steeled my heart. All right, Mila is already where we want her, and then. Break this, dance you from here, move you over here and reposition you. Or even better, move you here, then reposition you here. Because what I want to do is move her higher. So she can just straight up go up for the tank, tanking everything from the get-go. So right here, she can even take out Sophia or Bramimon if I can get her here. And then I can just get uh, Elgar over here, I guess, and that's it. Yeah, we'll go with that. We must end this. Break this. Dance. The choice is clear. Yep. Very well. Who do we want to kill? Guess we'll take a brown one. You go here, and no matter where not moves, I guess she, if she moves here, then I guess Leaf can go one, two, three, and hit air. But I my blessing. 
That's pretty much all he can do. And he's just not gonna kill air. I do not object. Truly? Death's caress. Yes. All right, Sophia. And then we have Iceberg already charged up. Ascended in Ishtar. Now I would like to give uh -huh. I think Guinevere would love to have like um attack rest finish just for the extra healing that she can get in like a lower cooldown special like glimmer or something. Take out Meadows. I'll cut my own path. Good morning. We must end this. Huh. Lord Asker, guide us. The glimmer of life. Mm -hmm. Like this. I do not object. Yeah, Tiandra will attack Edelgar since Truly? Edelgar doesn't have this encounter. Maybe this way. I do not object. Death's caress. It will be done. Well, we have about six minutes. Should be plenty of enough time to just finish this and watch those replays. I'll cut my own path. Very well. Yep, we can just do something like that. The choice is clear. Break this. Are you certain? Break that. And finish it off. I have steeled my heart. All right, and that's it. We finished the season. I guess um, that stall team does not like. Um, probably had some trouble if people run like uh, Mikaya as a bonus hero because she just stares through a team like that especially because she could have done it before she could have initiated it on turn one all right we got a peony a plus nine plus fifteen dimitri with godlike reflexes defense rest finish post smoke and phantom speed uh, and is that death rest finish that's gonna save him right here uh, we got fjorm just Base Fjorm for bonus unit, Chrome, Asker, and Edelgar. And so, in order to charge up Godlike Reflexes. So, yeah, Veronica. That rest that he's getting in Godlike Reflexes. Which only activates for Phantom Speed, not because he actually outspeeds Veronica. This is one thing that I did not like about my team. Uh, the way that Robin just 
breaks that instead of like moving. I wish like Robin would move before um, before Nod because then she can just pass through Nod and break the same tile but put herself farther forward. All right, so otherwise we won't be able to watch the other match. And yeah, um, I think Edelgar had no debuffs right there. And from here, it's just stalled a little bit to get the ether. You do, and of course, move over Chrome. They attack with Chrome for no reason. And the last match. We have Uller. Uh, plus 10, plus 20, Winter, Ephraim, Ether, Unity, Wily Fighter, Death, Death Rest Near Save, and Steady Breath. Um, doesn't he have like accelerated cooldowns anyway? Um, units not adjacent to an ally grants that during combat, inflicts attack. No, nope, I guess he doesn't. Uh, Ash. Yuri, Tana, and Peony. Yeah, you can kind of already really tell what the problem is going to be right here. Again, uh, sub vault, you can have that one unit loss. And that was just, they just got lucky. Minus seven. So yeah, is the uh, infantry school right there that hit Sothis minus seven? It allowed her just enough to survive, and unfortunately, uh, Ninian got too far away for uh, the attack speed form to be effective. I think she only needed like two two points of speed to be able to. Double that Uller. And that is it. That is it for the season. Uh, we're with Tresier and um, Altina next week. Uh, it is not water season, so Fjorm would not be available. But it is uh, wind season. So I think Mikaya. I think Mikaya is win. Uh, other than that, it's pretty much the same. Um, currently, we have this team set up, but I don't think... No, this team is... Yeah, fire and wind, so... As of right now, this team does work, except I do have to change the bonus structure. All right, and that's it. Um, I'll leave this for right now. Um, I might switch it out. It only loses me 24 points, so it's not that bad. But other than that, that is it for this week. So um, I sh all of the videos have been uh, uploaded pretty much 
daily. I just had been really short on time to like create a thumbnails and all those other stuff. So if you're watching this, it means that I, I may I finish setting up all those videos and I put the proper thumbnail and everything on him and they should be releasing within a few hours of each other so I'm sorry I spam your uh, subscription box we should be normal next week hopefully fingers crossed but other than that that is it so thank you all for watching I'll see you all next time bye